just outside and I'm intrigued. Birthday. 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 Earth Day. Cool, cool. That's so awesome. We're gonna pretend I'm not that stupid. Um, <laughs> I'm Kieran. I don't know what Earth Day is. I go to Bellevue West. I'm a junior. <laughs> Um, this is Maria. I don't have a role model, but I wish I did. I'm sure it would be easier or better or healthier for me. I've, I've tried, at least. I've kind of almost looked up to people for certain qualities. A lack of control over who someone is as a whole is the usual suspect for their demise in my eyes, so I go for the pieces. The fierceness of a mother's love, a teacher's open acknowledgement that, yeah, he's sometimes stupid, because there are parts of the hearts of those around me that soar into heavens, even if I'm not sure I believe in them. My grandmother, my abuela, is the second youngest of 13, orphaned at half that, still a teenager when she packed her belongings and hoped Jesus would remember his mother's pregnant plight through foreign lands as she carried her Hail Marys out of Mexico. She is the holy creator of a future beyond the card she has been dealt. I love her more and more every day. Sure, I don't love the part that hates me, berates me for Life choices God and I haven't found middle ground on. The one that lit a dozen prayer candles the day I came out to her. And yet, that side of her is still connected to the woman who learned English as a lifeline for her dreams of something better. Even when that better mistook her for the maid of children she made. My dad didn't bring friends home. Too tired of explaining that yes, those rolling R's were his heritage. He was just a little watered down by his own white father because as the Swedish side said, you have such blonde hair, I can barely tell you're a mutt. He got Andy. It isn't your fault, you're a half-breed. As if her dark skin had dirtied his blood. As if there was anything on this earth as pure as a mother's ability to endure. The words, stones thrown, aimed at the hearts. But my abuela has already moved so many mountain ranges, made a home in so many hard places. So I don't have a role model. But I have a shrine to Santa Maria de Jesus Martinez long woven through my ribs, even when the Virgin de Guadalupe sometimes burns my lungs. The stories of my abuelo working three jobs, raising four children on her own are inscribed along my bones. I admire her in a way that aches with every breath. And so I have learned to love parts that mean more to me than the whole.